Nikki. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if you're new. And in today's video, as you can tell by the title, we are going to be doing a little Dollar Tree haul. More specifically, Dollar Tree Beauty, a period. Because Dollar Tree Beauty, let's make a brand. Yo, that'd be cool. What if they came out with Dollar Tree Beauty? DTB. Dollar Tree Beauty. Anyways. I had to go and I had to go to Dollar Tree to pick some things up for my daughter. And by daughter, I mean my new doggy, um, which I haven't shown you guys, but I will. I've been trying to train her because she a little, she look crazy because like, you know, she a puppy. <laughs> but, um, so I'll do a little video with her, I guess, showing her off because she's the cutest. I mean, like, maybe I'll insert a picture, maybe, like, maybe. But I had to do some shopping for my little daughter, aka doggy. And... But I had this master plan in my mind. I was like, yo, when we go to Dollar Tree, I'm going to just, like, start picking up beauty stuff. Because I was like, I haven't, I haven't been to Dollar Tree in so long. And <laughs> I'm not going to flag. When I was younger, like, I've always been into, like, makeup and stuff since, like, middle school. So, and I used to go to Dollar Tree a lot. Like, a lot. Because, like, why well, wouldn't, I mean, it's fun. It's like a field trip. So, I would used to always get, like, shampoos, conditioners, different makeup. I would get, like, different hair things and you know and so i was just like okay when i go there like i'm just gonna start adding stuff to the cart and that's what i did and i got them um so yeah so i'm just going to be showing you guys what i got and yeah this is my exact outfit that i literally wore i just came back we cl i cleaned every single thing that i got everything everything that my mom got everything that were mine everything that were my doggies i cleaned everything and now I'm upstairs. I cleaned my room a little bit. I mean, like, you're probably like, ill it's a mess, but like, I cleaned it a little bit. I actually have to vacuum and stuff um, so that I have to make sure that really there's nothing on my floor. So I'm probably gonna vacuum like two or three times, like, within the next few days, just so that like there's nothing on my floor. So that when I finally can bring my puppy upstairs to get her accumulated into my room because she's gonna be living with me um, and sleeping with me, so that like she doesn't pick up on anything because she's very okay. This isn't about my dog, but so I'm just going to show you guys what I got from TJ Maxx, apparently. No, Marshalls, apparently. Um, Dollar Tree. So I'm just going to go in the bag and like randomly pick some stuff. So let's just get straight into this haul. I'm living for this look that I did today with this Ariana Grande top with... Do y'all care? Yes. With these boohoo biker shorts, but here's the gag. They are so long and it's hot as hell outside. So I rolled them up and they're actually so cute and they're comfortable and they still fit nice. Like 10 out of 10, totally recommend. Let's get into the hole. Okay, so the first thing that I picked up was were these cucumber and aloe. Oh, micellar water. I didn't even notice. Micellar water, cucumber, facial oils, cucumber and aloes for all skin types, advanced formula. There's 30 of these in there for a dollar. It's from the company, um, please excuse me if I'm pronouncing anything wrong, um, Bolero, Beverly Hills. Um, I don't know. I just thought it was, I like cucumber and aloe products sometimes. So I just thought it'd be something like interesting to try. And plus, you know, I ran out of facial wipes, even though I don't think facial wipes are the best for your skin. But sometimes for me, I like to really go in, especially if I'm wearing like a lash. I like to really go in with like a facial wipe. And yeah, it may take off some of my lashes, but to really get the lash glue. Because when I tell you, when I wear lashes, I have lash glue on my eyes for days. Somebody please tell me a solution because i'm fed up next product i got is this wet and wild brush it's a small eyeshadow brush i really like wet and wild brushes so i just wanted to pick these up because i heard that they were at dollar tree and here they are so this was a dollar obviously while we're at it this is another wet and wild brush i live for a really good angled contour brush and like i have like two or three so i was like let me just you know so here's another one i got um, this is a hairstyling kit. It comes with like a comb and then like one of those, I don't know exactly what it's called, but it's like a dense brush. Uh, they call it a styling brush. It's like a dense brush, but, um, I've always learned that even when I would do like my ponytails and stuff and I was using gel, that that really helped, um, stick my hair down. And right now, as you can tell, obviously my hair is like gelled down, but it's not like completely like, you know, and it may be because of the gel, but I think it's because I'm only using my hands and I don't have my, um, the brush. So that's why I wanted to look for one because I remember having one from there when I was younger. So I found this little kit because I was like, oh, what, well, might as well get two for one, right? <laughs> 
We love a bargain. Next up is this Ampro Style Gel. Now, I think a lot of people have mixed opinions on this. I used to use this on my hair all the time. Um, but I did not know that Dollar Tree sold this. Now, this, of course, is the small one. But, like, I used to literally get the big tub. But, like, I did not know they held, they sold this. So, I just wanted to get it because, like, I didn't know they sold it. I also got one for my grandma because, like, twins. <laughs> so, yeah, they have Ampro Gel there if you're ever looking for her. This really does... Um, hold your hair like i'm telling you throughout high school like well not throughout high school because like I, my hair was a mess like majority of high school <laughs> but like when i discovered this like one of my friends she had showed me it and it really held my hair down like it really held her down because i was using jam imagine how i looked i had a ponytail and i used jam so my hair my curly hair was out with the ponytail i mean the ponytail was curly but that doesn't excuse it like and then i discovered Ampro pro style and she shaved me so i mean i would try it um unless it's bad for your hair then i wouldn't i don't know i'm i, I haven't looked into it completely but it did work well with my hair so if you're looking for something at the dollar tree to have that and i didn't even freaking know Next, what I got was this Spa April Bath and Shower. They have the under eye mask and it's a lip mask. I've never tried a lip mask, so I thought this would be cool to try. Um, I don't know how it works, but yeah, I thought it would be cool to try. So, yeah. And then I also, it's so interesting, I found Freeman. So Freeman, I use their, um, their like facial scrubs and face masks and such. And I didn't know that... Dollar Tree have them so they have this little two pack it is this hydrating aloe mask sheet um, so I thought that this could be good for you know hydration of the skin and just like relaxing like if you want a little spa day like go to Dollar Tree they have bath bombs they literally I'm gonna show y'all they have bath bombs and everything I was like step it up like period oh and then also I got these this global care beauty care collagen spa treatment mask and this is a face mask now this company is always at tj maxx and marshall's now of course tj maxx and marshall's have great prices but it's not a dollar and i was very surprised to see this at the dollar tree because i always get um products from this brand um at tj maxx mainly tj maxx marshall's has it as well same company but they carry different products and what I really like about this brand is majority of the time if not all the time that I always get their products for my skin they are hypoallergenic and they're not tested on animals also pH balance and I really live for hypoallergenic products just because you have a less chance of getting a reaction or for it irritating your skin and I love that because my skin can be more on the sensitive side so the fact that this is even available at Dollar Tree I'm happy to hear that so yeah um, I got this also from the same brand i saw this gold spa treatment mask so this is apparently like you know the one infused with gold i remember like i don't know how many years ago like all the gold stuff was like a thing for like your skin i never tried it so i thought i would buy it these um little packages actually just come with one so it's like one for a dollar but still i think would be a good um, option especially if you just want to try the product out for the first time Next, we have from the brand Spa Naturals Luxury Collection, we have this bath soap. Now, I love me a good bath. And this is an, this was interesting to me because we were looking at different like bath bombs and bath um, salts, like because they had Epsom salt there and we were going to get the Epsom salt, but I saw the avocado oil one and I was like, yo, I love me some avocado. I'm going to try it. So this seems like it's something good. It says on the front, the claims are it's calming and relaxing soak, nourishes skin and leaves it feeling smooth, soft, and supple. Supple. And wonderful, refreshing scent. So I thought that this would be interesting to try. I didn't know they carried things like that. So I got this for makeup. I got this LA Color Setting Spray. I I don't know. It It, it looked interesting kind of but i feel like one spray and i'm done but it was a dollar so whatever i don't i don't know i hope i don't know if it's good or not i don't know i guess i'll try it let me know if you want me to do a video like trying like the beauty products that i actually got from here uh, from dollar tree <laughs> um i got this elf lipstick it's in the shade classy 
it's like this pinkish tone I don't really wear lipsticks like this but I figured if I didn't like it I'd just give it to my mom she likes colors like this so it was like a win-win I got hair ties there's 15 in here for a dollar um, they're elastic they're clasp free I figured these were good um, I also got this elf eyeliner pencil in the shade coffee so it's like a brown I don't know if you can see it and I think that that would look cute in like my waterline one another thing that really surprised me that they had was a jade roller imagine I just got a rose quartz and jade and all different types of um, stones I believe I'm saying it right stone um, rollers from TJ Maxx and they have this jade roller now it obviously is miniature compared to the full-sized ones but it's sassy and chic the brand and I'm gonna try it out but if I think that if you want to get into like the whole you know facial roller with the different types of gem stones whatever they're called I think you, it would be a good idea to try it from the Dollar Tree first maybe and it's probably good I don't know so I'm, I'm gonna try it and let you guys know I found these socks they say number one dad and I just thought it'd be funny to give to my dad because he always wears socks I mean obviously in his shoes but I just thought it'd be funny so I'm gonna put it on his bed and I wonder what he's gonna say he's probably gonna be like what is this I'm be like hey number one dad but yeah number one dad socks um I found this Freeman I didn't even know they carried hair product or like hair masks but this repairing honey hair mask now obviously it's small so it's probably for one use so a dollar for one use but i think it's good to try it out um so it's like after shampooing apply a generous amount of clean damp hair um leave in for three to five minutes but i don't know you probably don't even i don't, honestly this probably isn't one use you could probably get two uses three three at the most two uses depends on like how thick your hair is and such but i don't got no hair because i cut it video up here but uh, I want to try this because I don't know it seemed interesting for my hair. Ooh, I got these I got these facial scrubbers. I don't know. They look like brush cleaners to me, so I don't know what it's gonna do for my skin. But it says it deeply cleanses and massages. And there's two of them in here, two for a dollar. So I found that to be interesting. <sighs> Let me tell y'all a little story. When I was younger and I used to buy makeup, I used to buy it from Dollar Tree. And LA Colors was like, if not the only brand, like the most popular brand that they had. So I had everything LA Colors. And this shimmering loose eyeshadow with the brush, there's a hella shop there, with the brush was my jam. My eyes shimmering every day. I don't care. So um, I wanted to see what this was about because like, I don't know if it's like still, I don't I was younger so I didn't really know the difference between good and bad makeup so I don't know if it's good um, but when I tell you this was my jam like when I was cleaning like out all my makeup and stuff like I had a bunch of these in different shades of like pink so I figured I'd get a bronzy shade um, I don't know the name of this shade unless I'm just dumb and not looking I mean it says radiant in the corner but like is that the name I don't know um, <laughs> let me know if you ever use these because when i tell you these were my things like these were my things like you couldn't tell me you couldn't tell me crap like i was that girl with this on my eyes like lord so next i got this elf um perfect blend concealer it's in the shade light beige um i don't think the undertone is correct for my skin it's more beigey but I wanted to try it. They didn't. They one thing about Dollar Tree is also they don't have a good shade range when it comes to complexion products. I noticed that obviously, like with foundation, there was literally only light shades, and I was like, "Well, I'm medium, so what am I gonna do?" But um, I wanted to try out this concealer to see. So if you guys want to see me try it, let me know. I also got this LA Colors um, Define defines and fill brows brow pencil um this looked interesting to me it's in the shade medium i hope it's the color um they had like blonde and stuff but this was like i think the deepest shade i could find from brows um it seems interesting it seems promising it's just a brow pencil and it does come with a cap that has a little spoolie which i don't know if it's gonna be like janky janky d gimmicky i was gonna say dimmicky hmm. english gimmicky or not but this was cool to find i thought that it would be a 
cool idea because honestly at this moment I don't have a brow product I just realized that I've been using eyeshadow for my brows which I don't mind but I want to try that out to see from that same beauty brand that I was telling you about that I always find at TJ Maxx um, global beauty care I found this clay gel face mask with the applicator it has vitamins A C and E 15 minute facial therapy um, I just thought it'd be interesting to use. I don't really know the claims of it, but it is hypoallergenic, which I, like I said, I love. I live for hypoallergenic product, and they work for me. So, also, I was so shocked to find this. I found pawns at freaking Dollar Tree. Pawns that I spend ten dollars on at Target. Now, granted, it's the size, but you can get a good amount of use from these tubes. So the first one is. Pond's Clear Solutions Facial Foam. So it's like a wet your face. It's like a it's a facial foam. This is also a facial foam, but it's a detox one. Um, with activated charcoal, carbon charcoal. And then this one is with IDK, doesn't say. But it fights 10 oil problems. So if you're oily and you want to try this out, you can. And then this one is also, I think, just good if you prefer charcoal products and detoxing your skin so i'll definitely be trying these out and i'll let you guys know and last but not least cotton swabs i love me some cotton swabs whether it's for makeup my ears to clean but be careful when you use cotton swab on your ears um or in your ears i should say um but yeah you can do a whole bunch of things we also use cotton swabs for my dogs sometimes if like we need to clean certain areas around their eye because they do have allergies um yeah so i believe that is it from what i got so thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed if you did don't forget to like this video and comment down below comment down below your favorite finds at dollar tree they have great home decor items and everything so like i said i even oh my knee that hurt wow but like i said that we even got things for my do dogs that have great like storage um components at dollar tree as well oh my god like sponsor me i'm literally like <sighs> anyways but let me know and um subscribe to my channel and for more content like this like i'm so i'm literally so happy right now that i went to dollar tree like i had not gone to dollar tree in years like years um so yeah don't forget to like this video comment down below and subscribe to my channel and i will see you on the next one bye Take me to you